What up y'all? Welcome to another video on Amazon Driver man. Today I'm about to show you guys how to do flex routes. I don't know if you ever do flex route on a big van like this. You know, but today let me show you guys. So they gave all the rescuers or all the drivers all flex flex routes, okay? All flex routes. And right now things are not looking good at all. Flex route, you drive everywhere, literally everywhere, okay? Non-stop. So for today, let me, I'm gonna show you guys how my van looking right now, okay? I just loaded up, I scanned everything. You um, you must scan every single package. Now, this is not scanning bags or whatever. You must scan every single package in the van, in that bag, okay? You must do that. So let me show you guys, okay? So this is how my van looking right now. I already sort things out the way they're supposed to, um, the way they're supposed to go. And if you're doing flex, it goes by this number right here, okay? You have to look at this number. Don't look at the whatever the thing is or whatever, like, you know, um, the, the way that the, the, this number goes, but you have to look at this number right here, okay? Those numbers, those are very important. So I just sort all my stuff out, you know, envelopes, I put them right here. This is gonna be my first stop right here. So I sort out my bags. In this area right here, those are my bags, you know, the envelope bags or whatever. And see, sort out everything the way they're supposed to go in order from there all the way to the back. And right here, we got our regular envelopes, okay? This is how I sort them out. All nice and neat, and then those are the last thing I'm gonna do. So people still like, you know, loading and stuff like that. You got people putting stuff like, you know, up front. You know, things are crazy right now. This takes so much time to scan and everything you see, people are still scanning. So much time to scan, it's just not good. Hey, open your van, let me see that. Huh? Open your van. You see, my man also already sorted his stuff out. In the easy way so he can deliver them. And then this is, uh, he already put some stuff in front right here that he's gonna deliver first as well, just like me. You know, so most people do the same thing, but it's just that, like I, like I was saying, it takes time to scan all this stuff. You must scan each and every single package in the van, okay, or in the bag. And pay close attention to those things right here, okay? And one thing about flex route is that you don't start, you know, you don't start at the regular time that you guys normally start. You know, they let you guys start like, you know, two hours or three hours later, you know, with the flex people. You know, it doesn't make no sense. You know, if you know we're going to be driving everywhere, like, you know, everywhere, you just, you know, give us the stuff like, you know, early so we can be able to finish it on time. And some of this stuff, they're going to be late, you know, but we're still going to deliver all of them. Yes, but some of this stuff is going to be late. Some some of these customers, they pay like, you know, they pay too much for, for their stuff to get there like early or fast as possible or whatever. But it is what it is, man, you know. At the end of the day, we're still gonna be, we're still gonna deliver all of them. Anyways, anyways, let me go ahead and close this thing. I'm fired up. Right now it's hot. When I say hot, it's like a 98 degrees, okay? And one thing you need, the cooler, okay? Go to Walmart and go buy a cooler, okay? You can put some ice on, water, whatever you need, okay? Like a lot of Gatorade. Whatever you need, you really need that. That's your best friend right here. And it's too hot, man. It's like 98 degree right now. 98 degree, literally. The temperature is so hot, I had to take my shirt off, man. I'm sorry, I had to. It's 98 degree and it's so humid and hot. It's just crazy. I already went to like six bottles of water and I'm still thirsty, bro. I'm still thirsty. But anyways, man, again, that's how my truck is looking. Let me show you guys on the rabbit how I usually do flex route, okay? This is actually a three flex route that I'm doing. Three of them, okay? This is three flex route. So today apparently they give us, the regular drivers, they give us a flex route to do. So, you know, they choose and pick who they're going to give it to because the company knows who can get it done, okay? Some people, they're really slow. You cannot give them a you know, flex route because they're going to take all day long to deliver that thing. You already know. And like I was saying again, it's really important to check the numbers, okay? Don't go by the address or whatever that thing is, you know, don't do that. 
you know go by the numbers this is really important like see you look at this number look at this number right here like you know those address like you know they're gonna be close to each other okay and then some numbers they're gonna be like you see like this like 34 whatever that's to, to a little far 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 away and then that's how it goes all the way to like 150 something you know so yeah and this is my rabbit that's what it's saying right now 79 stop so right now I'm about to deliver this because it's gonna be late but then I have to start from here which is that package right there and come down all the way down here okay so uh, we're in Gatesburg right now by the way so by the time I finish I'm gonna be all the way in Darn, Darn, Darn Sound you know Gatesburg and uh, near Potomac North Potomac area right now I'm taking a break uh, it's so hot it's still hot you know the temperature dropped to a 97 degree you know but it's still hot so I'm just trying to take my break you know I'm still drinking a lot of water so I did ate a little bit and that's what I wanted to say like you know before you start your shift just make sure you eat good okay eat good and drink a um, good amount of water because it's gonna be a long day for you and for those of you uh, new drivers that come over here and try to be the best driver everybody's the best driver okay just come over here if they give you a route you get a route and you get it done okay if you know you're struggling just raise your hands and then uh, call the dispatch and uh, they're gonna send a rescue to come in and rescue okay but other than that just uh, stay safe on the road you know just uh, keep on drinking your water you know just work smart okay don't work too hard you're trying to rush trying to run and do all that extra stuff like no okay just take your time do your delivery you're still getting paid per hour so just you know take your time and do your delivery but just get it done that's what it is in this neighborhood where I'm about to deliver right now, all these customers, most of them know me already. I've been delivering right here in the past uh, three months, I guess. So if they see me, they offer me like water and things like that, you know? And if I don't have uh, enough water, you know, I'll take the water and I drink water, you know? But most of these people, they're pretty nice, you know? They do care about Amazon drivers and stuff like that, okay? So there's some people that do care about us, you know, some neighborhood, but some neighborhood, you know, you go there, they don't even care about you, they don't look at you, you know, it just, they don't treat Amazon drivers, you know, right, that's all, but, and I really like this neighborhood too, it's pretty new, around Clopper Road area, you know, it's pretty cool, man, these people are sweet, the neighborhood's quiet, you know, everybody mind their business, I like that. Yo, right now it's about 5 o'clock, 5.30. Man, if I tell it's hot, it is hot, bruh. It is so hot, bruh. Man, look at my arms. It is so hot, man. You know, this is when you put in work, bruh. <laughs> I told y'all, man, if you're coming over here and think the job is going easy, the job is not going to be easy, okay? It is not going to be easy. But again, we still got to do it, man. I got one, two, three stops. Plus the one bag, so that's 13 stops. Okay, I got 13 stops left. Man, look up front. I went through a whole body of water, man. The whole body of waters. See, that's the only one that I got left. Plus I get it right, I mean, probably right, and then down right there, man. Look at Hermes. What I do, brother? You finished? That's my Hermes, man. Boy, oh boy, oh boy, you boy is done today, man. I'm done. You know, and that's the guy that I was helping. You know, that's the last guy that I was helping. He was struggling. You know, he had a whole bunch of apartments and then some some town townhomes. You know, I helped him out, but I'm done right now. I'm just gathering everything together to take it back to the station. You know what I'm saying? It's been a long day. It was a long day, man. It was too hot. It was too hot. Right now, it's 7.25 p.m. Yeah, man. But yeah, you know, for y'all that want to drive for Amazon, Come in, man. Come in. We don't return no package back to the station, man. You got to deliver everything, bro. Everything.